Thank you for choosing Catalyst of Change Consult. Like, subscribe, and hit the, the notification bell to get more updates when tutorials are uploaded on our channel. The user interface of this tutorial will begin from the 1. The menu toolbars 2. The map layer or table of content and finally the map canvas. Keep in mind that this video is just a quick glance into the user interface. Each tool will be used to its highest capacity in our next tutorials. Don't panic when we just mention and go through the features. Follow the mouse pointer as a guide. As indicated earlier, the menu toolbar will be explained briefly. It contains most of the features or tools used in ArcMap. It is located on top of the Map Canvas workspace area. Tools such as File, Edit, Bookmark, Insert, Customize, Save as, New, Catalog, Search, Arc Toolbar are located in the Menu Toolbar. It could be edited and items can be dragged from one end to the other as shown in the video. Some tools on the Menu Toolbar also contain some additional toolbar which will be shown in the video. As the mouse pointer is going through the features, just get familiar with its locations. Our next tutorial will indicate the functions of these toolbar one after the other when we begin practicing how to make maps and other uses. Furthermore, where the mouse pointer is located is where we call the table of content or map layer. Also, shape files which will be used to make layouts, maps, contours, roads and others are located at this area. It is an important interface to take note and be familiar with. Where the mouse pointer is located at the moment is what we call the map canvas. What is the relevance of this user interface? The map canvas is the workspace area, where most of map work is performed. Under the map canvas, there are tools such as data, layout view, pause, refresh and many others. Where the pointer is hovering around is an important feature as well. Thus, data view is where map is done, it includes editing of all the features on the work. Also, layout view is an additional feature which helps indicate features such as legend, scale, grid, coordinates, key map and many others to make the work complete. Thank you for watching. How to make simple maps and other layouts will be taught subsequently. A very big thank you to HyperCity GH Media.